This is a quarry where they extract granite, a rock that's used for everything from curbstones to cathedrals. Why? Uh, well, because it's incredibly hard. And hardness is what I'm interested in. That's why I've come to see a geologist called Anna Grayson. Anna, what are the minerals in granite? There's three minerals in granite. There's quartz, there's mica, and there's felspar. Now, this is fresh granite. This is clean granite, and you can see the minerals very clearly here. There's your mica, sparkling, you see it? And there's the quartz, this sort of white to grey, clear mineral. And this pink is the felspar, nice and hard there. So that's mica, quartz and feldspar. Now, all minerals have a different hardness, and Anna's going to help me find out how hard each one is. These are two other minerals, calcite and gypsum. But which is which? If I were to scratch one with the other, I could work out which was the harder. Should we try? Yeah. A harder mineral will be able to scratch one that's not so hard. Anna knows that calcite is harder than gypsum. So, as it's been scratched, this mineral must be the gypsum, which is softer than the one that scratched it, the calcite. It's called the scratch test. Can you use this to tell the difference between all kinds of different minerals? Yeah, you certainly can. And there was this wonderful man about a century ago called Frederick Mose who had ten minerals of different hardness, and he arranged them in order to form what's called the Mose scale of hardness. And based on that, I've got this. That's scratch on the uh... One is the softest and ten is the hardest. You see, everyday objects have hardness as well. A fingernail is round about two and a copper coin is round about three and a half. So if you were to get the calcite, you could work out its hardness. Have a go. Right. Try scratching it with your fingernail. Are you making any inroad there? No, nothing. Try it with a copper coin. Try the coin. Oh, yes. It's a very faint scratch, hasn't it? Mm. So I now know the coin is harder, the fingernail is softer, so must be in the middle at three. That's right. I guess my investigation is to find out which of these goes in which spot on the scratchometer. Exactly right. And you've got 45 seconds starting from now. Right, start with my fingernail. It scratches none of the granite minerals. How about talc? Yes. Softer than a fingernail. Now the coin. Feldspar, no. But this, softer than a coin. Mica. Pen knife. That's steel. Still has a hardness of six, and it just scratches the feldspar. Now for the ruby. Ten. Nine, it doesn't scratch the diamond, eight, so the diamond's seven, harder. Six, but it does scratch five, the quartz. Four, quartz three, is not as hard as ruby, two, and diamond is the hardest of all. <sighs> OK, let's see how you did. Talc, mica, felspar, quartz, ruby, diamond. Excellent, Howie. 